Hi guys, Jason here, Funnel Demo. So just thought I'd give you a quick um, demo really of a funnel that uh, I've been using to try and uh, just close people down after they've seen a webinar. So the way it works is it's like a, a quick survey and um, I call it the post webinar survey, as you can see. And, and what's gonna happen is they go to this page, you know, I'll send them an email once they finish the webinar. Only people who've attended the webinar with this and then they'll say you know did you enjoy the webinar yes or no um what stopped you from buying the course because i sell courses i can't afford it not enough information or i'm not ready so those are sort of three very common objections that you get and um what i'll do is it will send people to three different web pages three different click funnel pages depending on what it is that they press so for example, you can see down here, we've got a price objection page, then a not enough information page, followed by a thank you page, because on the not information, not enough information page, I'll actually get them to submit a little reason why it is that um, things didn't work out for them or they don't feel they've got enough information so that um, I can then combat that and you know get in touch with them and say, all right, okay, so I see it is, you know, you've still got this question, here's the answer. And then I've got a straightforward not ready landing page. So, you know, let me give you an example um, of the price objection page. So I'll just take you to there now. So there you go. We have a solution for you. So I'll just give them a, a quick video saying that, you know, oh, it's price. That seems to be the problem. Well, in that case, rather than just paying for the course all in one, which is 997, um, you can buy it with three payments of 397. So it gives them that option that I don't give them in the webinar. So that's the one way of doing it. And then the not enough information page, let's take you to that one. This one here is like I said, you know, so they they basically said they didn't have enough information to buy the course. So in that case, uh, you know, I'll get them to fill out this form here and then submit that question through. And then um, I'll be able to hopefully close them down once I know what it is. And then the last one was the not ready. Well, you know, as I've said in my page there, you know, this there's never a perfect time to start a business and I'll resell them on why they should get started now. There's the buy uh, the course button again, which takes them to the checkout. I'll give you an example of the checkout. There you go. So this is the checkout page that I've built with the progress bar and all the benefits and all the money back guarantees and so on, you know, the, I'm using the table rush, the digital table rush uh, feature from ClickFunnels. And then um, I always have a little back to the top just to get them straight up there again. So that is uh, my little system there that I'm testing out now. I'll let you know the results. I mean, we can go to we can go to statistics now. Let's just let's just go. I've only just literally just started this. Uh, and yeah, we can see there's already a few people starting to go in. And you can see the simple way to see where everybody is at a glance is uh, unique visitors price objection. So what it is, is they've come in here, look, there's seven people, seven unique visitors there to, um, you know, survey landing page. And then they've been redirected based on their answers to these pages here. So you can see that somebody has, well, five people have said it's a price objection. And then uh, not enough information was only two people. And then of those two people, some people have actually filled out the form. These are probably just me for tests. These are um, so ignore those. But that's how you do it. And then once they've completed that form, they'll go to the thank you page. So we can see that, yeah, I'm the only unique visitor there that's gone through. But I think this will work quite well rather than just leaving them. You know, we send them to the replay. That's the usual technique, isn't it? Send them to the replay, give them 48 hours to watch it, pull the offer down, all that stuff. I'm just adding in another element of like really trying to combat their specific objection um, to buying the course using ClickFunnels. So I hope that helps you in some way, maybe with your business. And uh, I'll speak soon.